Hey guys, happy Friday and welcome into this edition of Shrimp Show. I'm your host, Matt Davis. Now that we're back from the All-Star break, let's take a look at four of the top plays from the first half of the season. Went all the way to the majors, the pitch. Bouncing ball up the middle, behind second, through in the center. LeBlanc around third, heading for the plate. It's a walk-off jumbo shrimp win for the first time in 2022. And it's seven victories in a row. Norrell Gonzalez. 3-2 again, he swings, lifts a hard high fly ball to left center. Back is Burdick, leaps into the wall, crashes, and he makes a great catch. An amazing catch by Peyton Burdick in left center field, leapt at the warning track, crashed into the wall, and he held on for out number one in the inning. Oh my goodness, that's got to be the catch of the year so far. The 0-1 home to Gonzalez, he swings, it's a fly ball to right. Back is Wilson, he's at the track, forget about it, it's out of here and a two-run shot for Norrell Gonzalez. It's six to five, Jacksonville in the bottom of the seventh. 1-0. Fly ball hit pretty deep to right center field. Long run for the center fielder. Burdick near the wall, dives, and he came up with it. A spectacular catch. Racing back to first down, Monte. They double the ball. What a play, Peyton Burdick. Tonight we open up a three-game weekend series with the Charlotte Knights. Jacksonville will feature the left-hander Jesus Lazardo, who will be making a rehab start. On the other side for the Charlotte Knights, they'll turn to the right-hander John Park, who comes in with a 2-9 record and a 6.83 ERA. It's another beautiful Friday here at 121 Financial Ballpark, and you know what that means. The Jumbo Shrimp will be taking the field in their Red Bull City jerseys. Any fans that wear red can save a dollar off their ticket at the Miller Electric box office. It's also Friday Night Lights here at the ballpark. Fans can save $2 off 12-ounce Miller Lite products or a dollar off craft beers. You can find those specials at the Craft Cave on the third base gate or in the brown canopy in left field. It's 70s night here at the ballpark tonight. Prepare for a lot of funky music. It should be a groovy time. And make sure to stick around for post-game fireworks presented by Corona Seltzer. That's it for this edition of Shrimp Show. Go take advantage of those Kraft and Miller Lite specials and enjoy tonight's game.